What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we got some market talk, we got some market tips, we got a ton of tips for you guys today in this video. And uh, yeah, market is very interesting. I'm gonna go over everything with you guys in this video. MT method, snipe filters, all that good stuff. Make sure to drop 20,000 MT in the comments, like the vid, and sub if you are new. So now, um, here's the thing. So I got the I got work for the next Monday through Saturday for the next. Um, Monday through Saturday, seven to five of the next um, three weeks. So my new scheduling on YouTube is going to be one video between ten o'clock and one o'clock Eastern, and another video when I get home from work around five six. That is gonna be what I'm doing. I'm gonna try my hardest to post some quality content for you guys, bro. I'm on the grind, so let's keep it going. The likes have been amazing. You guys have been goaded, so let's keep it going. Um. Right now, man, the market is crazy. I'm gonna go over everything with you guys in this video. As you can see, I have a ton of MT, and I also have a ton of MT to sell. Uh, I have a ton of cards to sell to make MT. So we're gonna get into the market. I'm gonna tell you guys what you exactly need to do and whatnot. But uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. So right now, the market is so high. Um, pretty much anything you guys have you should sell right this second because Friday they're either gonna drop for uh, prime packs or some crazy flash set or they can maybe drop flash super packs I don't know they could drop something crazy I'm thinking prime too but it could be flash now what is Friday Friday I think February 1st is Saturday maybe they drop something Saturday on February 1st they could have another token market update, not maybe next week or the week after. So right now, everything is so expensive. And honestly, I'm keep trying to keep Perzingis, but it's making me want to sell him. I literally want to sell everything I have because I can't believe how crazy uh, crazy expensive the market is. I got Chris Bosch for 130s around 180. I just sold one sell for 190. 150 with like bro. I really want to sell cards. I saw Hakeem the other day. He was at one. I saw one buy for 122. He's around what 200 something K now. I just saw one sell for 210. Bird was at 150 the other day. He's at a 200 something K. Um, we got Zion. He was at 130 ish, 140 ish. He was at 200. Now he's at like 200 again. Um, I mean, it's crazy. Bird is mad expensive. Every every card in the game right now, Carmelo's dropped. And also, I want to talk about the Jeremy Lin challenge. So, if you guys do want to do the Lin solos, I would recommend doing them. Honestly, now everything's really cheap. As you can see, Kawhi 150, Melo 200. You could do the whole set for around 400k, which is down a lot. So, if you want to do it, I would recommend it. Personally, I have no time to do these solos. Um, I literally just have zero time. So, I'm gonna try. I think I'm on number 10. I'm going to try to get these done, man. It's so hard when you're just shot after work, man. Like, I literally come home from work, uh, make the videos, and then literally go to the gym. It's so miserable. I wake up, I do it again six days a week. So, yeah, it's shot. And it's not only that, it's manual labor. So, it's even more shot. But we're still out here grinding for you guys. And it's crazy. Um, Some snipe filters I want to talk about right now. First off. Um, the pink dye mellow filter, not mellow filter, the Jeremy Lin filter. You guys need to try it out because if you do get something, you are a MT millionaire. Um, pink diamond J Lin minimum buyout 550. Um, just keep trying it. Honestly, I've heard in my comments a million, like literally almost 25% of my subs have been trying this and they missed a lot of pink diamond snipes. So, they were like, yo, I miss Mellow for 10k, I miss Mellow for 50k, I miss Mellow for 75k. I was like, bro, really? I literally, I've tried it for a little bit. I really haven't had time over the last couple of days. But, supposedly it's money, so try it out. This flag filter is pretty solid. Um, also, man, diamond filter scrolling through positions has been solid as well. Um, personally, I like, I really don't snipe too much during the week. I'm gonna not gonna lie. Friday, Saturday is probably the best time to snipe every time. Friday, Saturday is period, period the best night, like best time to snipe in general, like whatsoever, whatever you want to do. If you want to snipe hard, you got to go hard on the weekends because when packs or whatever, any, 
any pack drops of any sort. So like, let's say they drop a juiced, insane prime pack, bro. You literally have to run to the auction and you need to look at my methods and snipe all day. Considering like when packs drop, yo, Eddie Johnson at 20k is such a snag. He's so good, bro. Like literally 95 and 90. I might pick him up right now. 6, 7, long and lanky. Beast. I might have to pick him up. But uh, yeah, like I said. So what you guys want to do? Right now, period. I mean, literally take this method and literally you got to do it. I think that's a snipe. I don't know. We're going to take the risk. I'm going to take the risk. Um, Right now, you have to sell everything in your collection. Don't ask me anything. Don't ask if I should sell this player. Go to your collection. Sell either today or tomorrow before anything drops. If anything drops, that is my problem, okay? I'm trying to get rid you gotta get rid of your cards before anything comes out. That is number one rule. If something drops, it's not my fault. Try sell today, try sell tomorrow. This week might be a very good stock week, which means um this week might be a really good day. This nah, this week might be a good week to stock up on cards because this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking prime packs are gonna drop, which means market crash isn't really gonna happen. So if you do snipe cards. I'm trying to think. If you do snipe cards on Friday, Prime Packs, market crashes for a little bit. Not really crash, but it has enough flow to get sniped. So now, what you want to do on Friday, one filter that I would recommend you guys do try is Amethyst 20 or the Diamond Filter and just wait on the cards because they're fast paced. You can make a ton of MT in very quick, quick, quick fashion. So I would definitely try this out. Um... Oh, 6,500 where AD is. So yeah, try this filter out. Try out the diamond filter. Why do I say this, guys? Because, bro, when prime packs come out, it's kind of easy to snipe. And not only that, market crashes a tiny bit. And then on Sunday, since there's not a crazy like market crash or anything, you can pretty much just sell anything you did get on Friday. It sells fast on Sundays. And uh, Sunday is a really weird day because that's where I usually make sell most of my investments is Sunday. But honestly... After the death of Kobe, I literally don't think they're going to drop anything crazy this week. I honestly feel like that, like, they're, it's kind of, like, sad for them to almost drop something. So, I kind of feel like they want to reboot the auction a little bit, rise it up a little bit. But then again, I could be wrong. But, uh, yeah, I really, I really can't stress this enough. You got to get as much MT as you can for Friday, Thursday. They, you, they've been liking to drop, they've been dropping a lot of stuff on Thursday, too. So, if you guys want to follow my tips, you can. All I'm saying is today's Tuesday. You got to get be prepared to, uh, what's it called? You got to be prepared to have as much MT as you want on Friday. Like, period. That's it. You just got to get ready for Friday. Every, every week, bro. Sell your cards. Get ready for Friday. Follow my MT methods. I always post methods online. And, yo. Eric Gordon is so cheap right now. AI is so cheap right now. There's a lot of cheap cards that if you guys want, you can pick up. Then again, don't do not do it, bro. Don't pick up any cards, man. Stay loyal. Keep your MT like I have my MT. Get ready to grind Friday. We're going to, yo, on Friday, I'm going to post all my investments to help you guys out. Whatever I invest in, make sure you invest in as well. So Friday, we could have a triple upload, maybe a double upload. I'm not sure. I have work Friday, but... When the new content drops, I'm going to drop a video at 5 o'clock and then probably 6, 7 o'clock as well, Eastern time. And I'm going to tell you guys what I did do with my money, my MT. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to really invest in cars until later that day. So I remember all the prices in my head. So still that day, I'm going to make a lot of MT. So right now, what you should do overall, sell your cards, get on the Amethyst 20 filter, get on the... Diamond filter, get on the Amet get on Amethyst filter in general. Um let me see right here. Amethyst filter in general. Try this filter out. That's pretty much really all I got, man. Just make sure you stack up your MT for Friday. Get ready for new content. Content can drop at any time, which is kind of crazy with 2K. Um fill up your collections, get those tokens up, token market update probably in two weeks. So yeah, get ready. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more content. That's all I got, guys. Peace.